Hello everybody, welcome back at Beyond the Blend episode 13. This is a weekly podcast by Alberts with Real Talk on Startups. My name is Clement Asse. I'm super excited to open the doors of our startup Alberts. At Alberts, we make a healthy life the easiest option through food robotics. And with this podcast, we try to show what we do week by week. We're grinding every week with the whole team and I try to share here what we do just for you. First up, please click that subscribe button underneath. It doesn't cost you anything. You can change your mind anytime and it really helps us to get the message every week to you. So it would be amazing. Please subscribe. Thanks. I'm checking in from our office in Brussels today. Um, I'm now at Greenbiz, uh, at a co-working station where we have an office. Um, I'm a bit sick this week. You can hear it. I have a tenor voice. <laughs> um, it's 11 a.m. now, uh, just before this goes live on Friday. Uh, really love you guys. Thank you all for checking in. I have something special this week, so let's dive in. This week, uh, we are launching... I don't have my button tool here anymore, but... Okay, drum rolls. Uh, we're launching a crowdfunding campaign. <laughs> yes, a crowdfunding campaign. It's the first time we ever do that. Uh, and in this podcast, uh, I have no guests for you this week, but something special. I want to dive into the crowdfunding, why we do it, how we do it, where we do it, who can join. I also want to show you some footage of a video we've made that will go live next week, exclusive here in the Beyond the Band podcast. So, one, two, three, let's go. It's actually the first time ever we open up a crowdfunding. Uh, a crowdfunding is an instrument that became more popular over, I'd say, the last five years. Um, when we started totally in the beginning, it wasn't that popular yet. Uh, at the same time, we always decided strategically that it was not the right moment to launch a crowdfunding. I'll try to explain you why in the first of five sections, and that is, what is crowdfunding? Well, crowdfunding is a way to finance a project or a business. Um, crowdfunding is opposed, let's say, to more traditional ways of finding financing. A traditional way is, for example, a bank who can give you a loan or an investor who can give you an investment. Crowdfunding is referred to people in the crowd and the crowd that could be used, so basically any city. There are many, many, many different forms. So some forms of crowdfunding work with where you buy the product in a pre-order. As such, you finance the company to go do the own work to get that product to you and you become one of their funders. Uh, Kickstarter is a famous platform. A second option is equity crowdfunding. And equity crowdfunding stands for you become a shareholder with that crowdfunding action you do. So you put in money into a project and you become shareholder of the project. The third option and the option we have opted for in this crowdfunding campaign is a debt financing crowdfunding. What does that mean? Uh, it means that you invest in a project and you will, over the years, get your money back with an additional extra, which is the interest on your investment. As you all know, and as many of us feel daily, it's really becoming a challenging climate on the financial markets for day-to-day -day business, but also for consumers in general. One interesting part there for investors is that after a long period of very low interest rates, now the interest rates are rising. That means that investing via a debt financing is actually an interesting formula for investors because you will get a nice addition on your investment back. Second topic to discuss, why do we do this now and what will we use the money for? So just recently, I think two or three podcasts ago, we will put the link here somewhere around me, <laughs> uh, we have announced funding news. Uh, which was really a big, big moment for us. It's a pre-Series A signing. Um, it means that there was an investment that came in in order for us to grow the business forward. Uh, and now in the extension of that funding round, we're opening up this crowdfunding campaign. Why do we do that? We do that because we are investing heavily in our local production site. Uh, local production means the production of the machines. So at Alberts, we have food robotics devices. Uh, robots that make blends, smoothies, soups and shakes on the spot. And in this crowdfunding campaign, we're opening up an opportunity for the crowd to invest in Alberts. I actually have some first exclusive footage for you. So let's dive into some screen sharing in order to see what is coming. Yes, indeed, we are setting up our production site. I've been talking about it many times. Uh, we've actually made a movie this week. Um, we have a new format. Uh, we devise a script. One of our colleagues devises a script in one day. We have one day, or actually preferably a half a day, of just video shooting. Uh, and then there is one day of editing. So it's a very fast format in order to get uh, some video content out. Uh, and we've made a first video. I just have some first footage for you. So it's uh, literally, literally the first time anybody can see this. But the cool thing is there is a really cool drone shot where you can see um, the production hall. Big shout out to a good friend of mine, Robin, uh, to give us that drone and to <laughs> hand it over to us. We definitely didn't crash it, Robin, don't worry. Uh, 
<laughs> cool. Uh, so let's take a look uh, at the hall here. Uh, so here you see me and then here you see a beautiful uh, screenshot. Take a look at that. This is our production hall. Uh, I'm super, super, super stoked about this. Uh, we were working all summer long in order to get not only the production up and running, get first devices out, but also now we have our own production hall, uh, very professionally set up. Uh, in order to go and get a, a standard capacity from the beginning of next year ready and out of our factory. So people who are signing in now on the business side, B2B side, so for machines, uh, can be sure that their machines will be delivered. Uh, it was a long time to get all of this up and running. We have 348 uni components, so it means it's a really, really, really long stretch to get it all going. Uh, to make sure the supplier network is up and running, um, so, so much work was done there. Uh, but right now, uh, the first setups are done, and with the money, we'll start expanding this production. Uh, so, if you're investing in Albus, you're investing in local jobs, uh, and with this crowdfunding, we'll make sure that this local production hub is expanding. So, who can join this crowdfunding? Um, this is the first time we do crowdfunding, so we do a rather small campaign. Uh, however, an important one at this moment, uh, because right now this production has to be set up, has to be keep on going. Um, the campaign today is with a Belgian company uh, that we've organized with. It's winminute.be, so shout out to the team of Winminute to set all of us up in only four weeks. It's really fast. Uh, everything had to go to the financial authorities as well, so it's really a lot of work for them, so a big shout out. Uh, who can join this campaign? Uh, well, people from Belgium can join this campaign. There are two loan formulas. Uh, one is a formula with an interest rate of 7% on four years. Um, this is a very attractive formula. All Belgian citizens can apply for it. Um, the second formula is uh, all Flemish citizens can supply for it because there is an extra coverage uh, by the Flemish government. It's called a win-win lening, so a win-win loan. Um, all the details can be found at winwinner.be slash Albert. We'll put the link here just uh, down below. Uh, so you can register yourself pretty easily uh, and get that investment going very quickly for you. The campaign has a minimum threshold of 200,000 euros to call it a success and to get everything uh, going. Uh, we've opened up to a maximum of 800,000 euros. Um, so let's see uh, what this will bring. I'm super excited. First investments came in at the first moment it went live, so it was super exciting to see. So we're stoked to follow this up further and really looking forward to get you all on board. So thank you very much, everybody who already invested and who's considering. It would be amazing if you could, uh, if you could join us. So thank you very much. Last topic to unravel today is risks. It's very important. Uh, an investment in a startup is always a risk. Uh, any investment has risks. Um, it's important that you're not betting the farm on Alberts, as they say. So please only invest an amount, and I say this also to all my friends and family, so only invest an amount that you feel comfortable with that will not wake you up at night. Uh, an amount which is a fraction of your savings only so that you're never in uh, trouble. Uh, the money you're putting in Alberts is warmly welcome for us to grow the business, but it has to be an amount that you yourself can afford flexibly. Um, depending on the type of loan, it can start from 500 uh, or from 5,000 euros uh, per investment. Um, so please visit winwinner.be slash Albert. Check out very well all the descriptions. They've really listed down all the risks nicely as well. So it's professionally organized. I really hope uh, this can be an easy way for you to uh, join and support Albert. Uh, we'll keep you in the loop uh, about how everything's going and how the campaign is going over the years. Uh, so you'll be able to follow us a bit closer. And uh, yeah, thank you very much once again for those who already did and for those who are considering. Thank you for joining us, but do consider the risks. Let's wrap up for this week. I know it was a very short episode, massively busy with a lot of stuff. Uh, so this week was short, but that funding round was super important. I'm just showing you very quickly the win winner page. So here you can see the win winner page. It's a beautiful page created by uh, the win winner team. Um, they describe very nicely the different formulas that you can invest in. They describe nicely our investment case. Everything's beautifully explained. Uh, so we will also add the video that you could see the first footage already today to this. So yeah, thank you very much for all uh, checking this out uh, and following us. We appreciate all the support you do. Thank you for following this weekly and see you next week. We'll have a super cool guest, so stay tuned. Bye-bye. Ciao.